All right, good afternoon, everyone. My name is Trevor Thompson. I am the owner and the operator of TNT Pressure Cleaning, based in Ormond by the Sea, Florida. That's central Florida, serving all of Volusia County. Today, we did a house wash, mainly cleaning the soffits. The house is getting ready to be painted. So we removed a sign, which was the previous owner's last name. And that was, um, if you, you know that 3M sticky uh, tape, that was used. So we had to be very careful in peeling that off. Um, the house does need to be painted, but some of the paint is still in really good condition. But uh, there are some streaks and some running areas and some areas that are just aged with sun, and that's uh, par for the course here in Florida. So, as promised, here is an after video. Um, I'm fighting the weather, so uh, if you'll bear with me. This is all you need to know. Trevor Thompson, give me a call at 386-453-4213. There is the weather that's coming in. So we've had sporadic showers off and on, but of course that doesn't affect uh, that doesn't affect me at all. You can see it's getting kind of dark. So what we're gonna do, guys, is we're gonna take a walk around the house. Um, this is uh, a 12 horsepower general pump uh, providing 4,000 psi at four gallons a minute. Uh, this machine is a Honda operated machine. BE makes it and um, I have had nothing but great things to say about this machine. Uh, we're working on probably, I've had this one, let's say, uh, almost two years probably, maybe a year and a half. So if we take a look, we've done the columns here, we've done the retainer wall inside and out, we've done the entire house. Now mind you, there are soffits up top, and that's why that X-Jet is so important. Uh, otherwise, you guys would be on a ladder trying to shoot that. Um, or getting up on the roof. I can shoot that from the ground with my X-Jet, and as you can see, those soffits are bright white, okay? There is not a wasp nest, mud dauber nest, or a speck of black anywhere on this house. Um, this is uh, uh, a guy that I've been working for. He's, uh, he has many properties. You can see the soffits underneath. Just absolutely beautiful. All the window frames, um, totally spectacular in immaculate condition. We'll walk around the side of the house. Uh, this house is a little under 4,000 square feet. Um, and uh, as you can see, it's your typical Florida house. But one thing I wanna point out to you guys when you're looking at this video, if you'll look right here and you see that black in right there, okay, that is asphalt staining. Okay, that comes from the asphalt shingles. Now, what happens is when the rain hits it, the asphalt loosens up and it drips and it leaves a tiger stripe stain. There is a chemical on the market, um, several chemicals on the market. Gutter butter is one. Um, uh, what's the other one? Um, gutter clean, spelled with a K. Um, great stuff. It's an additional service. We come out, put about five ounces to a gallon of water in a bucket with a scrub brush, and we go around and we get all that tiger striping off. So that's what we're going to be doing. Our solution removes organic matter, dirt, grime, algae, mold, mildew, bacteria, tannin stains, spider webs, uh, any of your you know wasp nests and mud dauber nests. So, um, but as far as asphalt staining, um, there is a chemical that we use to uh, take all that off. Um, so that will be being done. What I want you guys to pay particular attention to are things like that vent that was just absolutely black, the windows that are, I mean, look at how beautiful these windows are. Just amazing. Hello, everyone. Um, so this house came out spectacular. Now, one of the things that I did on this house, um, there's tiger striping again. You can see it there, how it drips through. Um, and we're gonna be coming back and uh, removing all of that. Now they're gonna have the house painted, so we'll wait till after the house is painted. Um, and then we will go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and shut the residential water off. Uh, that way we're not wasting water um, from the homeowner's supply. The machine has been turned off. So we did this entire screened in enclosure, which was full of spider webs. There was a big wasp's nest right up there. As you guys can see, there's not a trace of that. The soffits are just absolutely beautiful. If uh, I hope you guys can see that okay. Uh, there you go. So that's what it should look like, guys. Um, gutters are immaculate. 
completely clean and white all the way around the home. And um, what I was saying before was inside this screened in porch here, uh, this patio was really bad. It had a ton of sort of carpentry stains, if you will. Um, you can still see a couple here, but those are actually dig marks from the lawn. That's where I took a, um, a 15 degree tip, a very aggressive wand and, um, and did some scrubbing. So um, this was a very hard patio to get this nice. Uh, all of the walls are done, of course. Your light fixtures, your ceiling fan, your windows all the way around. Um, you can see there's just not a spider web or a mark anywhere to be found. Uh, the concrete, that is as clean as it's going to get. I literally uh, was busting into the cream, so I had to back off and be very careful. That's actually very good. It looks really nice, um, especially compared to what it was. You guys can check out the after or the uh, before videos to see that. This is the balance of the house with the soffits. And uh, so I'm gonna cut this video short because I hear some thunder and lightning. I wanna get my equipment back in the trailer, head home to my beautiful family where I can make a well-deserved lunch. So as you guys can see, this has just come out fantastic. Absolutely beautiful all the way around. Uh, this, what you're seeing in here is this wall drying. This was the last wall that I shot. So uh, that is drying, but you can see those soffits are just immaculate all the way around the side of the home. So if you guys have any questions, things you wanna talk about, give me a call at 386-453-4213. My name is Trevor Thompson. I'm the owner of TNT Pressure Cleaning. I'd be glad to entertain your phone call or if, perhaps if you're a homeowner or a business owner and you wanna get scheduled and uh, get yourself cleaned up. Um, we do amazing work. Uh, I take my time, I'm meticulous, thorough, and detailed. Um, I don't leave any stone unturned. I'm not your blow and go guy. I don't come out, dust off, and leave. Um, and uh, what I'm, what I'm, one of my goals is to overturn that stigma that, that goes on in this industry. And um, you know, I've said it before, any alcoholic guy can go to a pawn shop, buy himself a rusty pressure cleaner, throw it in the back of his pickup and consider himself a pressure cleaner. Be really careful. They can destroy your property. They can push water up under those soffits causing more harm than good. You'll end up getting more mold than you ever would have in the beginning. So you really need to know what you're doing. They can rip screens, they can buckle foundations by pushing too much water up, uh, kill plants, kill grass. You gotta know what you're doing. You can get yourself involved in organizations like UAMCC or PWNA. Those guys are uh, a, a wealth of information. Um, YouTube videos are fantastic. If there's a certain thing that you want to look up, certain surface you want to learn how to clean, uh, you can YouTube those videos. There's just a ton of research and a ton of information out there that wasn't always out there. So um, I uh, really like to pride myself on being educated and having the knowledge and the skill set in order to perform the task at hand. So once again, guys, here is an absolutely gorgeous home done by TNT Pressure Cleaning. Thank you all very much. Have a wonderful Tuesday afternoon, and I am going to beat this weather inside. So uh, someone was looking out for us. All right, guys, have a great day. Thanks.